right, all right. Hey, I'm headed down to Psycho Gear, you guys. I had got exchanged my boots last week for another pair. Hey, I'm gonna tell you something about me and boots. A smooth top. Back in my sport bike days, I remember guys getting their foot caught in their damn laces in their gear shifter. But uh, I want a smooth top, but I ain't much into having all them zippers on my boots neither. I like that zipper to be on the inside, on one side. I ain't with all that daggum having zippers. All on the on both sides, shoot my damn hands off a tunnel. Hell, I can't daggum reach over there and be zipping up all them daggum zippers, y'all. So I'm taking these back to find out if they got some more. They ain't got too much of nothing in stock, and I'm scared to order stuff. So you order it, you wait. They usually come in a couple of days, but you wait, and then next thing you know, they don't work. Then you got to go back. And take him back and uh, order something else and then wait. And so uh, I got plenty of boots. I just wanted an extra pair. I wanted some tall sport bike boots. That's what I like to travel with. But they got to be comfortable. And they definitely have to leave my big toe alone. I can't have nothing hindering, hindering, <laughs> hindering my big damn toe. Or my pinky toe. It's got to work. Let's go in there and see what they got. Hey, man. How you been, dog? What you rolling on? Good God almighty. You had to do it like that, cuz. Yeah. That's that, that trying right with a rocket? Yep. My lord. Same kind of one I wrecked. <laughs> oh no, I didn't know you had one. Yeah. Uh, yeah, two thousand eight. I didn't know you had one. Mm -hmm. I didn't have it long enough. Probably why this thing, but I probably had that thing about three months. Oh already. really? That them thing, uh, that's got one of the biggest dagger motors mm -hmm. you can dog on fine, ain't it? Yep. Find you know gas stuff. Yeah, yeah. They said eat up tires, too. Oh, yeah. You, uh, uh... All right, here we go, you guys. Check out that old clean boot. Woo! <laughs> Man, you can't tell me nothing about these bad boys. That square tip toe, shoot. Milwaukee boot, I love them. Motorcycle boot, look like a cowboy boot. Milwaukee's a name brand, but that's just enough boot. If you act stupid, I'll kick my foot clean off in your hind end, and I'll break that daggum shoe off in your tail. We don't, we don't need no trouble. But that's what I wear running around town. You know, when you got your good pair of jeans on and you want to step out there and look like somebody, you can't never go wrong with a good Milwaukee boot. Do you hear me? Now tell me that boot ain't nice. Shoot. Here we go. Let's go to the next one. Yeah, all right, now this boot I've had for a while, built should have bought two of these bad boys. I love these boots. Waterproof. I can get a real good sock in there if I need to keep my feet warm. The zipper is on the inside. Awesome boot, man. They don't even make them anymore. But boy, you talking about a good riding boot and a lightweight. And they're and they waterproof. Shoot, I don't like putting them little feet condoms on when I'm going down through there, man. But that is my built boot. Come on, let's check out another. Now this is my travel summer boot, perforated Alpine Stars. Them Alpine Stars. 
I like that boot bag. It's real lightweight, man. It lets enough air blow on that pinky toe. It keeps that big toe nice and cool on a good summer day. Check him out. Woo! <laughs> now, you tell me they ain't a good looking boot. Nah, skin surface. Got a little wear on them, but they good to go. Now, this is my Bates tennis shoe looking riding boot. It is a boot, not a sneaker. Non skid surface. I normally don't like boots with laces, but this is a nice boot that I could just throw on and ride to work. Non skid surface, waterproof. I got the clip on the front of them so my pants won't climb up my leg going to work. What do you think? This is the one I had traded for and went and bought. Sadiji. When you get a pair of these boots, you gotta say it like a Natalia. He's a Sadiji. Double zipper, waterproof boot. I love the way they look. They, they really feel good, but it was too much trouble to try to put them on. So, non-skid surface, of course. Riding boot by Sadiji. But well, I definitely don't think this one's gonna work. So, I took them back and I traded for these. Oh, while I was at Cycle Gear, I did buy me some Honda uh, cleaner and polish. I love to use that on my windshield and just the bike in general, but spend a little money. But well, here we go, Let's, let me show you what the ones that I did go with. There it is, y'all. There's the laces. I said I didn't like the laces, but I do like them when they're up tall and I got a good clean foot. Uh, top of my foot. I have the clip. The clip's on there so my pants don't climb up my leg. Man, I can't stand for pants to climb up my leg when I'm going down the road. Look like a daggum dope with a pair of shorts on there, right? But Sadiji. These are the Sadiji kind. And, uh, I think they're going to work out real good. Good travel boot. You can jump off the bike, do a little walking around. And uh, that's it, you guys. I think I'm good on the shoe game. And uh, ride with me. Please like, subscribe, notify. Hey, thanks for watching another episode of Slappy Adventures. Please like, share, and comment. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. <laughs> hey, stay tuned for more videos like these.